Good morning, friends. Are you ready for our morning message? Here we go. Hello, L-O-V-E. I know that word. If I take away these letters, that spells love. Lovely. Hello, lovely ladybugs. Today is w w w Wednesday, May blank, 2020. It's a very special number today because we are moving out of our team land numbers. Let's check. We have 16, 17, 18, and yesterday was 19. That's the last number in the team numbers. So what number is it today? Let's count together. 16, 17, 18, 19. Did you say 20? You're right. 20 land, two and a zero. We are not in the teen land anymore. We are in the 20 land, which means our numbers will start with the number two. <gasps> Look what I see. Two and a zero, two and a zero, two and a zero. That's a pattern. Wow. We will read the grouchy ladybug. Mm, did you ever feel grouchy? I have felt grouchy before. And we will read, look at a ladybug. Take a look at this. L-L-A-A-D-D-Y-Y-B-B-U-U-G-G. -G. This word says ladybug, and this word says ladybug. We're going to look at two things today about ladybugs. How many syllables are in these words? Butterfly, ladybug, bumblebee. We had a song and it went, butterfly, butterfly, butterfly. How many syllables are in that? Do you know? Let's try. Butterfly. Let's try with our fingers. Butterfly. How many syllables? Three, butterfly, butterfly, butterfly. How about ladybug? Let's try it. Lady-bug. How many was that? Let's do our fingers. Lady-bug. That's three as well. Ladybug, 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 ladybug. And this last one says bumblebee. Can you do that one on your own? Let me see. Great! Now it's my turn. Bumblebee. Let's do our fingers. Bumblebee. How many syllables? One, two, three. Bumblebee, bumblebee, bumblebee. Bumblebee, bumblebee, bumblebee. This one has three syllables for butterfly. Then we have three syllables for ladybug and three syllables for bumblebee. They're all the same. They are all Equal. Cool. Let's talk about this guy right here, the ladybug. The ladybug mm -hmm. has a very important job. Our question of the day has to do with that special job. So when we're reading our story and looking at our reader today, I want you to think about this question. Why is a ladybug important to growing plants. So think about that 
okay? They're very important to growing plants. So it's good to have ladybugs in your garden. But why? You tell me. But you can tell me after you listen to this story and look at the weekly reader, okay? I'll see you later, friends. Bye.